Well, it is a little shopping trip today. Now, I only really have to go to Walmart. But you know if I'm going to come all the way to Summerside, I'm going to the Superstore and checking out the cheap carts. So, let's go see if we can find any pink tags at the Superstore. I saw it for every $8, get $3,000 $3, points. That's not bad. Oh, lady. You've got, a, you've got a few good things. What's this? What's this nice fresh white bowl? Curly out of bones and bread for $1.50. Raisin bread and white bread, yay! Mm. Cinnamon buns for half price. Don't need any. Not bad price though. No name bread on sale for two dollars this week. Fabulous price if you need some. Okay, so two dollars a pound. Two, three, four, five, six of them for $10.39. That's a wicked good price. Believe it or not, believe it or not, we're short on pork chops. Weird, huh? Yeah, I think that's about it for meat and things. They've got some drumsticks, but we don't need any. All right, let's go check the cheap cart. So the pigs were supposed to be Walmart, but these are actually cheaper. So $4 a dozen. So the cheap cart got some interesting things in it. Here we have over here ruby red orange juice. Sorry, grapefruit juice. Why is that over here? What's the date? Oh gosh, that's expired in July, guys. Why would I buy juice expired in July? Come on. Chocolate strawberry chewables. Vitamin water, well, nothing on the cheap cart that I really want today. I want to go to Starbucks. I'm not going to Starbucks. I'm going to be good. All right, one last search through for some cheap stuff. And then we'll uh, head to Walmart. Mind you, there are some great prices on things. $2 a pound for tomatoes on the vine. <laughs> Last thing I need right now are more tomatoes. These are actually a good deal. If you can get these and they're half price like that, that's actually really worth it. It works out to be about $7. And it's actually a really good assortment too. Mm, fresh pasta for five bucks. This is perfect for the freezer. Beef samosas and chicken samosas. These would be fabulous in the air fryer. That might be a really good lunch today, guys. Yeah, beef samosas for six bucks. Yeah, I think we're gonna grab. <laughs> you know it's winter in Canada. But when all these things start coming out. Yep, it started to rain. <laughs> oh, it's actually kind of warm today, which is nice. It actually hasn't been this warm for a little while. I think we're about, I don't know, 18, 19 Celsius, that is, for those of you that are on Fahrenheit. <sighs> but I forgot my jacket at home. Alrighty, next up. Walmart. I must remember the allergy pills and to try not to get run over by a car. Ooh. Wow. Dollar sixty seven a pound for hands. Makes these about seventeen bucks. Oh that look right really there is thirteen. All right then. Good morning. I guess we're going to be buying a ham today, guys. Okay, I have to get some milk. So milk is 
Four twenty five a liter? Not bad. Sorry. Two liters. I also can't read. My bill looks really good, but not for $4. Some turnovers for Fred, three seventy three. dollars I'm going to get the red spray ones, too, because I like raspberry. He looks tasty for supper, two twenty three. dollars Back out. And some whole wheat pitas for $1.67. These make great little uh, pizzas. Okay. You told me there's fruit cocktail. We're going to hunt for the fruit cocktail. As soon as I remember where they moved it. Mm -hmm. Now this one's in syrup, but that's okay. I've been wanting fruit cocktail. Thank you for telling me it's here. Yay. It's crazy how some one little tiny thing can make your day, right? That's crazy. Yeah. Life cereals on sale, three for 10, and I can't reach it. There was a young lad working back there and he's really tall. I think I'm gonna see if I can find him. <laughs> so I used the baguette to knock them down and I grabbed three boxes of life. <laughs> okay. Okay. Quick cut, quick cook. <laughs> Steel cut oats. 277 bag. Which is a kilo, so not too bad. Now the classical is on sale three for nine, but now with all the tomato sauce and then the light marinara that I made, we don't need any. That's kind of a nice change of pace, isn't it? Do my eyes deceive me? Walmart pasta. Okay, what is this stuff like? A lot of people like it. Wow, so clean. Let me see if I can find a little one. Try that out, I think. I was gonna get creamer, but they don't have the one I want. That really sucks. Four ninety-eight. That's why we bought the eggs at uh, the supermarket. So, with the holiday season coming up, Walmart is still a good spot to buy turkeys. So the blue ones are 17 each, the red ones are 22 each, and then the gray ones, which I don't have any, are 29. It actually works out to be a really good price. Just to find out which one I want. What's this one? Ooh. Mediterranean French. Okay, that's it for Walmart. Let's get out of here. Guess who has to go back into Walmart because she forgot the allergy pills. Okay, so I grabbed the allergy pills. Did I not say, don't forget the allergy pills? But I also did do one thing. We got the obligatory bag of Halloween chocolate. So, yeah, had to do it. All right, time to go home. And I'll show you everything that we bought. Okay, I caved. I needed to pull a little bit of cash out and Starbucks was right there and yeah. I know they're expensive. I know I have coffee at home, but I can't make these. And I am way too cheap to buy the Starbucks syrup to make them myself, because that stuff's expensive. Yeah, it probably would last a while though. All right, this is everything. So we're gonna start with the Superstore. So I got the eggs, which were $4 a dozen. That's almost a dollar cheaper than Walmart, which is really, really rare nowadays, to be honest. The linguine pasta, so it's one kilo for 50% off and if you look it's actually in four sections So this will actually go through the food saver while it's still nice and soft And that's actually going to go in the freezer. So that works out for us really 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 well I got the four samosas for us for lunch today, and we're gonna have these with the cantaloupe 
that uh, we picked out of the garden because it really needs to be cut up and eaten. Half price cinnamon raisin bread and half price farm white bread. And these guys are nice and cushy. Cushy. Cushy's the way to go. It's the new word. Cushy. And I put a hole in the packaging. Oops. But these are all going to be separated through the food saver here anyway. But we got six massive pork chops. I mean, look how thick this is. Like, seriously. For $10.39. So, really, really good price. This is six meals for us. So, yeah. Works out well. So, at the Superstore, I spent $29.17 with a total savings of $8.80. So, actually, not bad whatsoever. Like, fabulous. Like that one kilogram um, of pasta alone was $5.15 because of a 50% off discount. There's actually about four more there. Of course, I don't need any more than the one, but hey, mission accomplished. Alrighty, let me show you Walmart. Check out that beauty. It is a hickory smoked ham, $13.14. For this nice, good size hickory smoked ham. Now this guy, when we do cook it, it'll get cooked and then part of it'll be put into other things. We'll probably use some for freezer meals, some for soups, some for breakfasts. This will actually, I have no idea how many meals this will actually do now that I say that. No clue whatsoever, but I guess we'll find out. We got the Apple turnovers, $3.73, not a great savings, but the Walmart turnovers are actually really good. And I also got raspberry turnover, same thing, $3.73, fabulous price. Okay, not the best price, I should amend that, but they actually taste good. The Quick Cook Steel Cut Oats, these guys were $2.77. Every time I've been going to get some of the Quick Cook, quick cook stuff, oh my gosh, they've been sold out. But now I got them. That makes me happy. The whole wheat Greek style pitas. Now these things, like I said, are fabulous for pizzas. And I actually like them when they're, well, one, double discount. But two, when they start to go that tiny bit stale, they hold up really, really well for like individual pizzas. Um, I got the baguette for $2.23. Two cartons of milk for $4.25 each. And... It's not in the budget and it's not going to be counted, but yeah, the obligatory candy. Shouldn't have bought it, but I did. It's got Whoppers in it. I like Whoppers. And finally, a Taylor Farms salad. Some of the salads for Taylor Farms have more in them or less in them. They're all the same price. It was like five forty nine, dollars something like that. But I'm sorry, I can't beat the quality. I really like Taylor Farm salads. So, yeah, sorry Walmart. Taylor Farms beat you out on this one. So the actual groceries at Walmart were $53.21. Oh wait, I forgot something. I forgot Fred's cereal. Three boxes of life for $10, which is $3.33 each. These things normally are like five bucks a box. Seriously, five bucks. If you're lucky to get them on sale, they're on sale for $3.99. Ridiculously rare anymore to get them on sale for $2.99. And the only reason I remembered is because at the bottom of my receipt, it says multi-discount, which was the cereal. Oh my gosh. Anyway, yeah, $53.21 at Walmart. So in all honesty, not a bad shop. Now I only went for milk, eggs, and allergy pills. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I went over budget, but a couple of things that have not been there for a while, like my fruit cocktail. Now, this is the stuff in the light syrup. Oh, yeah, I just realized. I didn't show you that. That's the stuff in the light syrup, and I like the stuff in juice, but I've been missing the fruit cocktail. I don't know why. I've got peaches. I could be eating peaches. Well, I have been eating peaches, but I just wanted fruit cocktail. Mission accomplished. Alrighty guys, so yeah, that's our shopping haul. Quick little trip, it was a fun trip. I enjoyed it today, I don't know why. It's such a weird day, not gonna worry about it. 
All right, time to put all this stuff away, and uh, we'll see you next time as we continue, I should say, <laughs> our simple life here on PEI. Bye for now.